So Gus is bringing Billy out for his final weigh-in with Daddy over here. Before he goes into hibernation. Try not to drop him. So we hibernate Billy from about mid-November through till the spring. So 1686 grams. There he is. Now when you hibernate a tortoise, they mustn't eat anything or drink anything for at least three weeks before they go into hibernation. It's very important that their stomach is empty. Now we've got the box here, so Simon is now going to pop him in. Billy is 12 years old and he's been hibernating now for quite a long time, so he's really used to it. So he goes into the box with newspaper. We've then got a lid with holes. So that goes on the top there. Followed by another lid. Polystyrene. Polystyrene, again with more holes. And then we wrap the box in chicken wire because rats have been known to get in and do all sorts of damage. So not with so, Billy, but with other tortoises. Not with Billy, exactly, but with other tortoises, friends' tortoises. They advised us to wrap him up in chicken wire. And we also get the pot of stone there because we don't want Billy to get, whilst he wants to be cool, he doesn't want to have frostbite. Definitely. Tortoises with a frostbite wouldn't be good, would no, it? No, it wouldn't be good. And then this goes in the sh in a shelf in the back of the garage until March. Let's put Billy to bed now. He goes for a very long sleep, doesn't he? Yeah. How long is that for? Um, until March. Can't eat until March. So how many months is that? So, which? November to December. Uh, December, January. Okay. January, February. Every month, about four months. Yes, I think it is four months, isn't it? Four months. So there is Billy's box on the shelf at the back of the garage. So he will stay there until March, and then I shall show you what we do to wake him up.